Hello everyone, you are welcome to how to solve this very nice radical equation square root of x plus 1 minus cube root of 2x minus 6 is equal to 2. Our job is to find all possible values of x. So let's start. First we suppose that uh, this expression is equal to a. Let a is equal to square root of x plus 1. If we square both sides, this implies that uh, a squared is equal to x plus uh, 1. And uh, if we move this uh, 1 to the left hand side, then this implies that uh, x is equal to a squared minus 1. So this uh, original equation will become a minus cube root of 2 times uh, in place of this x we write this expression a squared minus 1 minus this 6 is equal to 2. Further simplify this will become a minus cube root of 2 times a squared will become 2a squared and 2 times negative 1 negative 2 this negative 6 negative 6 is equal to 2 next a minus cube root of 2 a squared this negative 2 minus 6 will become negative 8 equal to 2 we move this 2 to the left hand side and this negative cube root of 2a squared minus 8 to the right hand side. Then this will become a minus 2 equal to cube root of 2a squared minus 8. And from here we take a cube of both sides. By using this algebraic density, m minus n whole cubed is equal to m cubed minus 3 m squared n plus 3 m n squared minus n cubed. This a minus 2 whole cubed will become a cubed minus 3 a squared times 2 plus 3 times a times 2 squared minus 2 cubed is equal to from the right hand side this cube will be considered with this cube root and we are left with 2a squared minus 8. Further simplify this will become a cubed negative 3a squared times 2 negative 6a squared plus uh, 3 times a times uh, 2 squared means 4 3 4 times uh, 12 times a minus 2 cubed is 8 equal to 2a squared minus 8 move these two terms to the left hand side this will become a cubed minus 6 a squared this 2a squared will become negative 2a squared plus uh, this 12 times a minus this 8 and this negative 8 will become plus 8 at left hand side is equal to 0 this uh, positive 8 will be cancelled out with this negative 8 and we are left with a cubed negative 6a squared minus 2a squared is a negative 8a squared plus this 12 times a is equal to 0. Now this is a cubic equation. If we check a is equal to 2 in this equation, then we notice that a is equal to 2 is a solution of this cubic equation, which means that a minus 2 is a factor of this cubic equation. So we rewrite this equation as we write this equation as a cubed 
we write this negative 8a squared as a negative 2a squared minus 6a squared and this plus 12a plus 12 times a equal to 0. From these two terms we can factor out a squared in bracket left a minus 2 and from these two terms we can factor out negative 6 times a in bracket left a minus 2 equal to 0 and this a minus 2 is a common factor so we factor out this a minus 2 and in bracket left this a squared and this negative 6a in bracket left a squared minus 6a equal to 0 from here is this expression a minus 2 is equal to 0 or this expression a squared minus 6 times a equal to 0 from this equation a will be equal to 2 and from this equation we can factor out a a as common factor in bracket left a minus 6 equal to 0 from here either this a is equal to 0 or this a minus 6 equal to 0 and from here we get a is equal to 6 so we have three values of a 2 0 and 6 to find the values of uh, x, z call that we have supposed we have supposed that uh, a is equal to square root of x plus 1 we have supposed that uh, square root of x plus uh, 1 is equal to a so when a is 2 then this will become square root of x plus 1 equal to 2 and we square both sides so this square will be considered with this square root and we are left with x plus 1 is equal to 4 move this 1 to the right hand side this will become x is equal to 4 minus 1 and x is equal to 3 this is the first value of x this is the first solution of this equation when a is 0 then this will become square root of x plus 1 equal to 0 and we square both sides so this square will be considered with this square root and we are left with x plus 1 is equal to 0 move this 1 to the right hand side this implies that x is equal to negative 1 this is the second value of x this is the second solution of this equation now when a is 6 then this will become root x plus 1 equal to 6 and we square both sides so this square will be considered with this square root and we are left with x plus 1 equal to 6 squared is 36 move this 1 to the right hand side this will become x is equal to 36 minus 1 and x is equal to 35 this is the third value of x this is the third solution of this equation so we have three solutions for this equation let's verify and see that whether these solutions are valid or not the original equation is uh, square root of x plus 1 minus cube root of 2 times x minus 6 equal to 2 first we check this 3 so this will become root 3 plus 1 minus cube root of 2 times 3 minus 6 is this equal to 2 and this will become root 4 minus cube root of 
6 minus 6 is this equal to 2 square root of 4 is 2 minus cube root of 0 is this equal to 2 and 2 minus 0 is 2 is equal to 2 you can see that uh, left hand side is equal to the right hand side which means that uh, this 3 is a valid solution when x is negative 1 then this will become root negative 1 plus 1 minus cube root of 2 times negative 1 minus 6 is this equal to 2 and this will become root 0 minus cube root of 2 times negative 1 is negative 2 and negative 2 minus 6 negative 8 is this equal to 2 and 0 minus cube root of negative 8 is negative 2 is this equal to 2 and negative times negative 2 will become positive 2 is equal to 2. You can see that the left hand side is equal to the right hand side which means that uh, this negative 1 is also a valid solution. When x is 35 then this uh, original equation will become square root of 35 plus 1 minus cube root of 2 times 35 minus 6 is this equal to 2 this root 35 plus 1 will become root 36 minus cube root of this 2 times 35 is 70 70 times negative 6 64 is this equal to 2 and square root of 36 is 6 minus cube root of 64 is 4 is this equal to 2 and 6 minus 4 2 is equal to 2 you can see that the left hand side is equal to the right hand side which means that this third value of x 35 is also a valid solution